All right, everybody, what's up? Thanks for tuning back in to another episode of Negro News. So check this out. Jason Whitlock, this guy, this guy right here. Yeah, this, yeah, this guy, this, this dude right here. This dude, I, I don't want to get in trouble, but, you know, it's my freedom of speech, my Fifth Amendment right. He's a coon. He's a coon, man. He's a he's a Tom. <laughs> he is a sellout. Yeah, I, I'm gonna say he's a sellout. This dude had the audacity to to, to attack Dion's son, calling him arrogant, hating on him because he's driving a Maybach, right? Dude, this kid is a millionaire. This kid was born a millionaire. If your father is a millionaire, safe to say that you're a millionaire. And he's gotten millions off of his names, off of his name, excuse me, because of his father, but he is now generating income because his arm and his, his, his earning potential, because he's a baller. Calling him a brat, he's arrogant. I mean, this dude is coming forward. This, Here's the thing, man. Jason Whitlock, you're a black man. To me, it seems like you have an identity crisis. Uh, it's a lot of people of color who suffer from, from, from this disease. And he has full-blown identity crisis or whatever, if, they, if there ever were such a thing. Yeah, it's out of control. He, it's stage four. Right. Um, we do 400 years of slavery, man. And you seeing people of color such as yourself who are successful and you're coming for them and you're hating. You're worse than you're, you're worse than Charleston White, bro. I'm sorry, because you really mean it. Charleston, Charleston just be trolling. You really mean it. This, this is coming from your heart. You got a lot of hatred in your heart, man. I don't know if you wasn't loved as a kid or what. But whether or not these guys beat Oregon this Saturday, it doesn't matter. These are black people, man, who are doing something positive. Oh, here's another thing. He came for Dion. He also said about Coach Prime, he said, uh, he's always talking about God, but he's surrounding himself with gangster rappers. Man, I'm telling you, I wanted to attach the link, but I didn't even want to give whoever posted it. I don't know if it's going to give give residuals to him. I don't, I don't even want to even aid in the bed this jerk right here. So I, I I didn't attach it, but it's on it's online. Go check it out. Um, yeah, he says uh, Dion is always talking about God speaking to him, and I'm not quoting verbatim, but this is what he said. That he always getting a, a sign from God or a message from God, but he surrounds himself with with gangster rappers, right? Well, tell me this, uh, Mister Whitlock. I, I heard you uh, say that you're a man of God. Who did Jesus surround himself with? I wait. Okay. Jesus surrounded himself with. The have nots. In today's terms, Jesus hung out with some real. You know what? Okay, so what are you saying? Stupid. All right. Dion comes from 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 uh from the hood, so he hasn't forgot where he's come from. Number one. Number two. You must have forgot the Dion. Used to rap. Dude, what, what is he supposed to be out there, man, with a robe on, being holier than thou? He's a man of God. But you're supposed to be winning people's souls, right, to Christ. If, you, if you're a godly person, you don't do it by shunning people, Mr. Whitlock. Stupid. Anyway, I'm not going to get his fool. All my energy, 
But I'm kind of pissed about that, man. I, I hate to see black people. I know somebody else. I ain't going to say your name. But you a coon too, Mr. Green. Yeah. Prime example, man. Nothing worse than a person of color who would take something and try to use it to belittle somebody. Man, that's that's the equivalent of a rat in my book. Might be a little worse. Well, it's the equivalent because if you're doing that, I know you're a rat. I know you will rat. You're rat, you're volunteering to be negative and drop condescending comments and remarks one after the other and post it. So I'm going to post this. And everybody who sees this, please share, right? This coon right here, I don't even understand why he even even has, has, have a platform. It's, it's, it's something called defaming a person's character, right? Defamation. I would, I would sue you if it was me. Yeah. That slander, bruh. You don't come from a person's come for a person's kids. Talk about another man, and 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 and, he, and he's this man is helping so many lives, man. So many young people's lives. Look at uh, he even said that Joe Horn Jr. Uh, Jimmy Horn, excuse me, his his dad is in prison right now. This 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 man Dion assured his father that he's in great hands, and so far he's proved himself to be true. Amongst other kids, did you not see that video of Dion consoling that white kid at Jackson State who dropped the ball in the end zone? Could have won the game, but he lost because he dropped the ball. And Dion went over there and consoled him and told him, "said Hey, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't cost us the game. We we lost. We lost as a team. We lost together." This man is is is, is making. Uh, changes in people's lives, man. And people like you, man, is why we're still on the bottom of the food chain because we don't pick each other up, man. Only time you're supposed to help somebody out is when you're picking them up. All right. Um, this fool right here, though, share this and, and, and go research it. It's on YouTube what he was saying. This, this, this dude, I can't believe this dude. This dude is um, unreal. You know what I'm saying? And Warren Sapp. Stop going on that man's show. I seen you on there a couple episodes. Don't go on the show no more. Man, it's time for somebody to put their foot down with this this fool right here, man. I seen Charlie Strong. Don't go back on the show. If, if, if you brothers is real, man, and y'all for the culture, and y'all about what's right, leave this fool by himself, all right? This dude is worse than... I can't, I, I can't find nobody who's... He needs a... You know who... All right. This dude is Clayton Bixby, 2.0. That, that is a great comparison, Clayton Bixby. You heard it here, Negro News. I'm your boy, Cutter Tone. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Share this. And uh, please do not entertain this clown no more. Okay? Thank you.